Hi, I'm Sarah from the Old Coming. Such a pleasure to be with you here tonight. I mean, this film's been called a love letter to South London, but it's also such a refreshing take on the rom-com genre. Why did you want to be a part of it, and what were some of the highlights? Oh, For that very reason, to be honest, it just took the rom-com, chewed it up and spat it out, and then took the conventional rom-com characters, chewed them up and spat them out, and I was like, I want some of that regurgitation. <laughs> it was as awful as that sounds, but yeah, I'd never seen a character like Yaz before. I didn't really understand her. She's a bit crazy, but I wanted to get to know her, and I empathised with her, so... Yeah. yeah, yeah, you know, all of those reasons, Rain Ella Miller, our director, is so beautiful and gorgeous and she, she has vision, you know, and as an actor, you, you want to run and she lets you kind of play. And that's what this film is, it's kind of an ode to like South London, us playing around and having fun, so yeah. Yeah, yeah I'd say Yaz is a hurricane, she kind of spins past people's lives and sucks them up and if they betray her fantasy, she spits them out. But I think, I didn't really understand why at first and I think it's just because, you know, she's escaping herself and she is lives in the air but she needs the ground and dom's that ground for her and i feel like dom's too on the ground and needs the levity of yaz and that's why i fell in love with them and their dynamic yeah yeah you know i think dom is dom is a he's, he's a young lad he loves football he loves his missus and that's ultimately his downfall but equally he's very emotional probably more emotional than me and myself but that's what was nice to play him because i think you know as a young black man we don't really allow ourselves a lot of that emotionality so uh having a chance to do that authentically, hopefully, and still be funny, it's, it's, it's good. Yeah. I love our British film. We come from the, like, why yeah. Lane wouldn't exist without like a kid You know, the, the, yeah. those type of, they just paved the way. Yeah. Oh, I mean, you know, one, one actually on, burning in the back of my mind is Lockstock. Uh, I'm an East London boy, so I love, I love films like Guy Ritchie's, like Layer Cake, Trance by Danny Boyle, Sorry. so good, yeah, yeah. Uh, just some happiness, man, some joy, like, you know, this is a film about loving and finding new love and, and yeah, anything else after that is like, that's, that's, that's extras, but just joy and happiness. David's in the best world, yeah. London dating tips, um, yeah. stop looking and then you'll find it. Fall in love with your life first and then life, love with the person will follow. Oh, no, we don't. I, I, I don't really read too much. You don't read my no. no, I really don't. But you know what? I mean, if it is talking about gentrification, we were talking about this actually with someone else. Um, I think Peckham is incredibly diverse, and I love that people, I love that it even gets people talking about something like that because, uh, yeah, it, things do shift, but for better or for worse, that's up to people to decide. Yeah, and hopefully, this film can just be a capsule for Peckham now, which is super special. So. Yeah.